Welcome to Lazy Cosmetics. I'm going to be showing you guys real quick how to do this Valentine's Day makeup. I'm very inspired today, so I hope you guys like the look. Leave me a comment below if it was easy enough for you guys to recreate. If you guys like the diamonds, the hearts, make sure you guys are joining and subscribing to the Little Lazy family. My name is Lucy G. Lacey, and here we go. Here we go, my dolls. We're going to start with rolling the hair around, and I am using a curly hair extension and i'm just wrapping it all around my bun over and over until i get it to the end and then we're going to be wrapping the end all around the bun making sure that the bun is not exposed we're just going to keep wrapping and wrapping and wrapping and wrapping and wrapping and wrapping and wrapping you guys like the wrapping and then you're just making sure that it's all even and there's no hairs going anywhere else Wrapping, wrapping, lifting your puff. Now we're doing the same thing to the other side. Like you guys heard, we're just wrapping and wrapping and wrapping and wrapping. And this is how we're creating our little amazing buns, you guys. Wrapping and wrapping, wrapping and wrapping, making sure hair is in place, taking off the little tie just to make sure that the hair is not moving, making sure everything is in the right spot. We're just wrapping, wrapping the hair around, just wrapping the extensions all the way around until we finish. And we get this amazing buns, you guys. There we go. Now we're putting on the Lazy Cosmetics toner. Time for makeup. Now we're using the Lazy Cosmetics brow soap. Now we're going in with the pomade in dark brown. We're just going to be chiseling up our eyebrows because we know we love these Instagram brows. Chisel, 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 chisel. I am leaving a space because we're doing a heart shape because I'm inspired today. We're using a purple pencil. We concealed it a little bit and then we added it for it to have more pigments. We're using the Lazy Cosmetics moisturizer and cucumber and hydrating our skin because if that skin is not plump then we is not good now we are cleaning up around the eyebrows with the lazy cosmetics full coverage foundation making sure our beautiful little hearts are not erased so we're cleaning around it making sure it's chisel 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 like always we're using the desert sand foundation from lazy cosmetics that i cannot live without the link is in the bio you guys make sure you guys check out our website don't miss out don't miss out if you guys need a color match Make sure you guys send a message with a picture with no makeup on. Next step, next step. All right, so we're putting that photo finish all over the lid. See how that is full, full coverage. That is waterproof. We're also going to be using the e.l.f. concealer in tan and light just to brighten it up. Make sure it's very, very light so all the pigments we gra will grab better and make our eyeshadows even easier and brighter to blend. So we're going to go in with a translucent powder from our contour palette and white just to make sure we have an empty canvas, making sure that the makeup doesn't go anywhere and everything looks beautiful and have, like I said, an empty canvas. We're going to go in with our blush palette because I wanted an intense hot pink and this one had the biggest intense hot pink I had. So we're going to be in that crease, blending, blending, blending. As you guys see, blending your lights away. Look how easy and nice this blush actually blends out. We're going to go in with our oldie but a goodie. We're going to go in with that color is life palette from Lazy Cosmetics. It is sold out, so sorry. But we're going to go in with that purple and a smaller, more intense um, brush and just blending everything out, making sure we get this purple and pink Valentine's Day look. Now we're going to go in with the pink pod and we're going to use that white shade. I didn't cut the crease because I'm lazy. I didn't clean it up. So we're cutting the crease now with the white paint pod right on top of that purple color. Super, super easy. Grabbing our flat angle brush. As you guys can see, everything is available on Lazy Cosmetics. You guys, the link is down below. All of our products are tagged below as well. So make sure you guys go check us out. Make sure you guys give us that thumbs up button. All right, we're going to go in there with the same hot pink blush. It's called Hot Ladies from the Lazy Cosmetics Blush Heaven Palette. And yes, I'm using a blush palette. Why not? Because I can, because I will, and I am. All right, we're just patting that in. Now we're adding glitter, you guys, because this look cannot go without no glitter and glam, because this is what we do. So I'm using the Lazy Cosmetics Pink Pigment, and this is the fine pigment, not the chunky. So this is the fine one, simple little brush, cleaning any little axis of glue with a little Q-tip, as you guys saw, adding a little bit of glue at a time so it doesn't dry, adding our mascara. I did run out of my Lazy Cosmetics mascara so we are using our huda beauty right now now we're going to go in with the lazy cosmetics primer all over the face and this is our aloe vera primer all over the forehead because we got to make sure we're hydrated and those pores are just erased 
Now we're going to go in with the Lazy Cosmetics Foundation. And this is a full coverage, you guys. We are going to be contouring and highlighting all of the spots on my face. Now we're going to go in with the e.l.f. Concealer and Rich, um, Rich Suede. And then we're going to contour around the face. Same process we did on one, we do to the other, making sure everything is chiseled and contoured. I am using the JLo's Makeup Artist's Technique, so I am adding a little bit of foundation as well, medium coverage, just to blend everything together on top of my Lazy Cosmetics Full Coverage Foundation and on top of that e.l.f. Concealer. But I went a little OD with this contour, so I am going to go in with concealer just to blend this out and make sure that my face looks all luminous and bright and highlighted and we don't look too extra tan. Do you know what I mean? We're going to be tan, but not that tan, okay? We're going to fix this up. We're going to fix this up. Blending it back up with that foundation brush, just making sure everything has a beautiful, even blend and I don't look streaky or stripey, okay? Well, that's not the goal. We're going to set this whole face with the Lazy Cosmetics um, Contour Palette and I'm going in with the lightest shade. And caking up this face, making sure that we absorb all the moisture because the Lazy Cosmetics Full Coverage Foundation Photo Finish is a dewy foundation and I do like a matte look. So we're making sure that we matte this whole thing up so our face is touch proof, move proof, everything proof. Now we're going in with the contour shade in the contour palette and making sure everything we did with the darker concealer, we are setting it as well. Very, very important. Go in there with your face power. Don't skip this step, you guys, so you guys don't look streaky, you guys don't look liney, you guys don't have any flashback go in with your face color powder doesn't matter if it's not in the palette grab a compact that's your same color and blend 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 for your lives you guys look how amazing i look set that face blush you guys i'm using the hot pink blush again because we're keeping in the whole momentum using our blush palette cleaning these fingers before we move on to our highlight 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 now i don't have a pink highlighter in front of me so i am using an eyeshadow from our you are a star palette because i can because i will i hope you guys are enjoying this as much as i am you guys i had so much fun doing this makeup look i feel like a freaking brat doll i'm contouring with the um, you are a star palette. I'm using a pink shade from that palette just to chisel up under the eyebrows and make sure the look looks finished and blended out. Grabbing that same pink highlighter that I use for an eyeshadow, I'm using it in the corner of the eyes to make sure that it all pops and under the eyebrows to give it that whole nice blend. Now we're going in for the diamonds because we have to put some diamonds in this look, you guys. Why? Because I can. Why? Because I will. Why? Because why not? So we're just going step by step. We're adding lash glue first, dual, and then we're placing the diamonds in place. That diamond wanted to play with me. Don't play with me. Stay, stay in place. I guess it won. Adding more lash glue. Going back to the other side, tracing my little heart. There we go. You can't beat me. I tell you what to do, diamonds. Okay, it's fighting with me, but it's okay. It's a process. Me and them are getting to know each other, okay? Don't get mad at your diamonds, you guys. Your diamonds love you. They just There's just a process you got to do with them. And then we're creating our hearts and our brows. Because like I said, because we can, because we will. Because why not? Again, lash glue, you guys. That lash glue needs to be applied, you guys. It has to be tacky and dewy by the time you're applying them diamonds, you guys. To make everything just work. Look at my little heart, you guys. Look how cute. Yes, look at the patience. Look at the patience. We did it, you guys. We had to speed through that next one, but we're doing one on the side, you guys. I got you. I got your back. We're doing it one more time, you guys. I didn't do an outline, so we're literally doing this freehand, just adding the glue. That one wanted to play with me. You see how these diamonds want to play with me? But it's okay. They can't beat me. I got this, you guys. We got this. Process. It's a process, you guys. It's a process. Take your time, you guys. This is not a race. Putting your diamonds on step by step. It is not a race. We got this. Lash glue again, making sure it's tacky and wet at every moment that you're applying these diamonds or they will not stick, you guys. Make sure that the diamonds are face forward, making sure we have an even heart, you know, because you guys know I be giving y'all some crooked hearts. So we're just trying to make sure. See them diamonds be playing with me, but it's okay, you guys. I show you guys the whole true process, okay? It's step by step, you guys. There's no shame in the game. Make sure, like I said, that lash glue is wet and dewy. See how that diamond wanted to play with me and turn around on me? It's not going to happen. I got this. We got this, you guys. We're almost there. We're almost there. 
there we go you guys we came a long way we're putting the hot pink number 11 liquid lipstick and then we're going in with the number two nude to give it some hydration because these lips be dry so we're going to give it a little ombre cleaning up around you know what you know making sure everything is perfect i hope you guys enjoyed this look you guys i did it with all the love in my heart putting on some mascara on the bottom to finish it up and i hope you guys enjoy make sure you guys follow and subscribe to lazy cosmetics facebook instagram tiktok and youtube love you guys